Hello everyone and welcome back to another episode. So in the last episode we have declared war on Peru because they have insulted us. So we're not gonna look like we're scared or anything. <laughs> we're just gonna show them who's the boss. But either way we pretty much almost have them siege except for Argentina which they are still on high enthusiasm which um, I would like to kind of piece them out white piece. I mean, kind of would have been better if we siege Argentina first and then piece them out separately, core everything, then focus on Peru. But that did not work out because, yeah, they kind of stacked our, well, not completely stack white, but they kind of destroyed some of our stacks. So that kind of ruined everything. So we kind of pushed all of our troops up in the front and just kind of stay all together. But either way, let's go ahead and continue the game. So far we're just going to finish off Peru, then I don't know, I think just try to peace out. Maybe siege Argentina a little bit, why peace? Get him out. Get 100% war score. And we will see. So I'm pretty sure at some point we're going to get a call for peace. So yeah. And I do apologize for no episode yesterday. Well, yeah, yesterday. <laughs> but that was mainly because I was focusing on building my second custom PC. So, I don't know, like... Episode... Technically... Well, I, I don't know, whatever. Just yesterday's episode, I, I just did not even think about it at all. <laughs> while... I was focused. Alright, so, either way. Either we can gain a bunch of money, or lose... Republican tradition, which we don't want to, or we can lose stability, which we're gonna lose stability. But we will boost it back up again, which it is uh, 118, which we will take. Alright, we're gonna lock that until we finish that, and maybe this one as well. Yeah, let's go ahead and move. No, nope, go there. Go in there, kind of block them. There, then there, there, then go there. We're gonna trap them. Okay, now they're moving down. Can I see us coming around? Okay, they're not attacking, but they are safe there. About to take this uh, somewhat close. I don't know exactly how Bolivia is, I mean, they're kind of getting sieged. Okay, we got their capital. And we had a uh, stack down here. Pretty much focusing on rebels. We are making a lot of money, which at the end of the war we do want to build up on our navy. Can we... Okay, we can. Look at you with that three star. Let's go ahead and get you over here. Let them be a little, little bit more scared. Alright, so who's arriving first? Fifth, first, and 29. Alright, go ahead and stay here for a couple more days. Uh, second, uh, you've been marching. I mean, that kind of messed up everything. Uh, the fifth, I think. Okay, fourth. Just stay like... There. Fourth, and fifth. Reinforcements. Alright, so we do have... Like, are they all flanking? Okay, they are. And... Do so still have some cavalry in the back? Well, that's mainly because, yeah, we do have more stacks. But one stack, I kind of want to see how it looks. Then we have some infantry that will... replace the other eye. Yeah, the front ain't looking too bad. Or, I mean, it's because, I guess... I guess their stack kind of... Moved everything and nope. 
I, I don't know what I'm trying to say here. Uh, let's get the smallest stack out of here. Or leave them in there, actually. Oops, wrong. Wrong province. We do have the general over there. So how much aggressive expansion do we have with the US? I mean, over, oh yeah, aggressive expansion, we have none. Alright, so we do want to split you guys off. What can I take right now? So we do want Lima. That's the war goal. Split them in half. We do want to block Bolivia. Probably sea tiles in the same place. Same, uh, sea tile. More sea tiles, right? Yeah, that's a lot of overextension. They will still Peru, Brazil, Brazil. We don't care. Which Brazil? We lose our truce in three years. Kind of cool off. No more sea tiles. The rest probably next war. Not even a 3%. Wait. Okay, we can take our 2%. <laughs> we'll take our 2%. We'll take all your money. Okay, maybe not. Screw that. That's gonna hit. Everything else next war. Alright, let's core everything from the top to the bottom, which I think we do have enough admin points for everything. But still, just in case, top to bottom. Uh, 11, which really isn't a lot, but I mean, we don't want to piss them too much that they're going to want my provinces, because they're never going to go back, maybe. <laughs> Canada. Hit me by one. Allied with the United States. Aggressive expansion. We do like them a little bit. Um, let's go ahead and improve relations. If we can get an alliance, I think I might take it. Because I'm pretty sure Canada is not going to be aggressive a little bit balanced a way of the United States not declaring war on us <laughs> uh, I think you go down here right yeah let's kind of move these guys Brazil is the next war Let's start from the top to the bottom. Alright, let's go to speed 5 since we pretty much have nothing to do. Alright, lose money. Your way, opinion. We really don't care. Just got an A stack. Little tiny A stack. Alright, uh, we do have a lot of money. Oh yeah, we want to get our fleet. Okay, so how much are we making exactly? 207. Okay, so where is our fleet? Not these guys. Oh yeah, they kind of... did they get crushed? No, they did not. So we have a uh, 12... 34... Um... Let's get a... What? Who has the highest heavies? We're going to compare. So maybe it's United States... 107. About our enemies. Brazil, 37. We'll try to get up to 50. 
Alright, so we want... So we already have 12. So 30H. Damn, the United States has a lot. <laughs> Uh, we have 30, 34, so it's 50, uh, wait, so that's going to be 50, let's try to get, should we get like what, 100? Seventy, eighty, ninety, a hundred. That's like fifty-nine. Don't care about the name. Just a one-time thing, you know. This fleet. Alright, we won the rebel stack. Cores are done. Uh, states. We have the mercs or the merchant guild. One in one land. Uh, and then at this one, this side. A little bit kind of kind of laggy. So I am building my second PC, so there won't be too much lag. Friends are gonna be up to speed. <laughs> but then again, we're in speed five. wanted to go with enemy now because we are done with military let's go ahead and finish the rest um, we do want to get them the merchants killed up to speed Instability or prestige. Core stability for now. But next time it's gonna be stability. We wanna stay at least two. Cause normally for me I always end up getting those events and if I take it then there's gonna be an a event that's going to take it away. Let's go ahead and do something. So Canada Alliance, huh? 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 Buddy all pile. Not rivals anymore. There we go. Barely took it. We have inflation reduction. The United States don't do anything. Alright. Truce with Brazil has gone away. Ship still being built. Let's build some buildings. Stock exchange is just ran through them. Everywhere.
Alright, what other buildings should we go with? Production. Ah, uh, what is this? Gain general with 50. Tradition, nice. Gold mine in Mexico. Technology, we are behind, so we get some infantry, cavalry, and artillery shot plus one. Naval maintenance plus 10%. And we're still behind. And adding trade efficiency. We can lose some um, military power, which we will. Maybe attrition. I mean, traditionally, we do have crappy generals. Or emeralds, I mean, so screw it. Some more military power, we will take military power. Point treasury. Which we will use. Uh, where's the rebels? Peruvian rebels, I see. Uh, no, that's not the uh, general we want. I'm just walking through Brazil. I mean, Peru. I don't know how, but okay. Advisor, um, so land of for land force to limit my fire or for defense. Um, we don't really need the defense. Uh, we can turn off forts, keep forgetting. Keep getting so many forts. Let's go ahead and run siege. And then move them back up. Another advisor. Spy network, I mean, it's not gonna be helpful. Okay, so we just have one more ship. We have an idea. Oh yeah, no, we're big. We're behind tech. <laughs> Never mind. All right, uh, you guys still have an emerald. This will be the non. Well, ah, screw it. For now, go protect trade in Mexico. Go ahead and merge with the other guys. And then, once we are fighting Brazil, we'll recall. And still making a lot of money. We can lower maintenance down. Um, let's go ahead and switch. There is aggressive expansion. Gone, but still wants some of my land. Gain money or lose ability. Well, gain money. Oh, Republican tradition. Uh, I, mean, I guess we can lose it. Alright, time for a war. Again. Alright, so declare war. Um, Uh, we can take their capital this time. It's in the middle. Bolivia, we don't need. Yeah. Back down to speed two. Oops. Oops. Merge you. Okay, there, there. Top to bottom. Uh, we don't need to call any allies. We are good the way we are. Uh, we can actually maybe go with the SP3. Mm, 
military leader left us. Uh, I think that's my two star. Seventy-nine stack. Gotta be careful. Make sure I keep an eye on them. Okay, focus on getting the troops a little bit more, more down. Uh, do we need? for the noise. Um, we do have big fleet. And we do have more more heavies. A lot more light ships. Uh, they do not merge. Don't. Eh. I just merge them by myself. Screw it. I don't think we need them. But either way, you guys, we're gonna go ahead and end the episode right here. Thank you guys so much for watching. If you have, but until next time, bye bye.